today I would like to show you quickly how to assemble the glide wind foil and then most important how to check that it fits your power box well and what to do if it doesn't. Normally the foil will come in the box already with the base inserted but there will be no bolt holding it together. So in the bag out between the bolts there will be this flat headed Torx which you insert in here. We strongly recommend using some sort of anti-seize grease available at the local hardware stores and this will really help removing the bolt later on after it's being left with the salt water and so on. You use the Torx to, to tie it really tight together. Once this is ready, it's time to try and make sure it fits well your power box. I'll show you an example of good fitting and not so good fitting board right now. So first what you do, you just take the foil and just place it into the board without tightening any screws. So you can see here, even just by very lightly pressing without the bolt, the plate onto the board, it's nice and tight. I, I tried to put a piece of paper and you can see there is no space. You have to know that it's normal that you might have on the sides like a tiny little bit of space, like for example here, and this is because of the different V's in the board. Really the most important thing is that you have a really good solid contact in the front of the plate. This is because here it's where all the force will be happening. Now I'm gonna show you how it looks in a board where it does not fit as well. So we do the same thing, just put the foil into the base without any screwing, press onto the base and you can see there is a empty space in the front. This means that the box in the board it's too shallow and that the foil is actually bottoming up. If you see that your board does not fit the foil perfectly and there is some space in the front, what you should do is use the provided pad. I brought specially yellow pad so you can actually see it, the one you get will be black. So this pad fits onto the bottom of the base and the one you will get will have provided self-adhesive backing so you can actually permanently attach it. So you can see now with pad in place I press lightly onto the base and there is no space. Everything is tight and you can put your bolt and go sailing.